Hi everyone, it's Janice and today I'm back to show another Alice in Wonderland junk journal I've just completed. I'm on a bit of a roll with these at the moment. I find I'm better off to make a couple and that way um, it's easier with all the ephemera. So the, it's a fabric one and the front of the book has a uh, the picture of Alice with the Cheshire Cat and all the characters. So I've cut them all out individually. It has been Mod Podge and I've just backed it on some tea dyed cardboard. Put some metal pieces around because it's like a steampunk grunge style. And then also the spine. I've added a piece of um, dyed doily to match um, the seam binding and the little pieces I've put on the book. It has got a charm there of Alice and that one's a heart key. As you can see it's detachable. I've sewn these little charms to these little shabby roses that I've made out of the cheesecloth. You can see more of the back of the fabric there with Alice falling down the rabbit hole. The closure is made with sari silk and I have um, double stitch that so it's quite strong and inside the book there I've put another piece of Alice fabric as well so this one's a little folder tied with um, some seam binding it opens up and it has a few um, a ticket and a little circle note card there this pocket here has some little note cards in it and then this one's a belly band and that has a tag. And this one, the tag sort of is a top loading one. So that one just fits up there. And I'll put that back later. And here's another pocket with an Alice tag in that one. And these have got little pockets and I've added some little note cards in those ones. It's got a lot of decorations, lots of quotes. I won't read them all out. And some little note cards in that one. So that one just um, goes that way and then it just ties up. This book's got um, a signature but it's also got a file folder in it so that's a little bit different to what my usual Alice books are. So it's got lots of writing paper. Um, the pocket there with a collage tag and I've put all these little captions have all been cut out and adhered to the pages. I didn't print them on there. Um, another collage tag. That's a piece of um, calico and I've stamped that with some Alice images on that one. And this one's an envelope and it's got a collage tag in that one as well. Of the rabbit. I've added, actually that's a little piece of calico I've stamped. Oh dear, I'm late. And my favourite character, the Mad Hatter. As you can see, it is quite a different um, picture of the Mad Hatter. Uh, this one's a little pocket with the famous tea party with some note cards and the tea party note card in that one. This um, page, I've joined it with fabric. It's just some Stamperia paper, uh, a tag and a mason jar. More writing paper. This one's another little file folder, a miniature one. And inside that it's got some note cards. And these are all cutouts within the book. That's a cutout, that's a cutout. I love sitting and cutting out <laughs> all the pieces. Uh, this one's just a tag flip and I've added some little circles to that one. This one's a flip down of some writing paper. Who are you? 
and this one's a flip out more writing paper tag and a note card this one is the middle of that first signature and I've made four pockets so in each of the pockets there is a note card matching like that's the queen off with her hair cheshire cat alice and the mad hatter and that has a, a little key charm there some more writing paper i've just collaged down for decorations on that page we're all mad here more writing paper there that is a no, that's not a cutout. I've printed that one on there. That's the other side of that tag, this time with some of the cat on there, the Cheshire cat. More cutouts. This one's a pocket, just a collage pocket with um, a note card and a tag. They're all cutouts on the tags and the note cards. This one's the other side of that um, fabric pocket with a ticket and a note card and a couple of note cards in that one. And a pocket this side with a little note card and a circle. That's actually washi tape down that side. I just loved it. And I've used so much of it. I'll be sorry when it's all finished. And I can't remember where I bought it from. That one's a piece of cardstock that I um, distressed and put a stamped image of Alice on there. And there's some ink me, eat me and drink me tags. More writing paper. Another bit of collage. Um, decoration there that's another piece of washi tape across the top this one's an envelope and that one's got a note card actually I made those quite at some time ago just some playing cards and I just sewed them and stamped them and then just attached them to some tea dyed paper now this one's the little file folder so it ties up with some seam binding, I'll just move that a little bit, and it's got a note card in here of Alice, and this one has um, a note card in that one, playing card, and this side it's also got the rabbit. You can e easily write on that envelope as well as that one as well. Another note card in there, that one's a postcard and another one actually that's one of those um, playing cards again and it's been gessoed and that one's got some um, pattern paper I've collaged over that one this one's got another one of the playing cards and I've made a little pocket out of some vellum and put some little tickets and you can still write on the back of that one that one just fits in there and actually that's a Mod Podge note card that one and more note cards in here and this little middle piece I didn't make a pocket because I loved all the quotes um, from Stamperia paper so I've just put a little mason jar note little note thing there so that just um, folds in actually that one goes in there and then it just ties up I've got two ties here so I've got to watch which ones I'm tying up because I actually um, tied the note paper that I've sewn in with wax thread I've used um, a page from storybooks actually oh it's further around so there's some writing paper in the middle there's a little key there and that's just been sewn into the file folder there's a piece of the um, storybook and some circles within that teacup 
And this one is also a storybook page and I've matched, that's a piece from the storybook and I've just made a note card out of that with a cut out there of Alice and the pocket matches that one. And the last page in the book. So this one has a pocket. Oh, actually I made the pocket so it's that's the backing on it. And some tags and another mason jar. I really enjoy making Alice's books. There's another one coming soon as well. So that's my latest one. That's the back of the fabric. And that's the front of the book. Thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.